So what's up, Herd? Welcome to Finding Teddy 2. For those of you guys who didn't watch the first Finding Teddy, it was a very fun game. It was actually pretty awesome. I like the style of it. I like the uh, art style and everything. It was just like, it was a lot of fun. It was a cool little story. And um, this, however, is Finding Teddy 2. And from what I've seen from the trailers, it's oddly different. The first... Was this Legend of Zelda? Uh, okay. But um, from what I saw, it's largely different as it has a battle or combat perspective now rather than you're in a point-and-click adventure which kind of is what the first game kind of felt like and it had a very musical sense to it as well this one from the trailer though it does seem very different i'm not sure how much i'm going to like it compared to the first game but it does still have the same art style but it does seem like they tried appearing appealing to a larger audience um is there a video that's going to show because it says press any key to skip what am i skipping is it just the music? Something's supposed to be happening on the screen right now. It's it's a black screen that says press and press any key. Okay. So it looks like we're no, this isn't the same room, and I think we're the same girl though. From what I remember, when she grew up, that's what she looked like. I mean, it would have to be the same girl because you're finding your teddy again. Oh, power outage. Or did the game just shut off? Oh, I got a sword and a shield. Okay, I'm also using my PS3 controller as um, Xbox 360 controller. So, okay, so, ooh, ooh, ah, ah, oh, ooh. Okay, this is gonna be fun. Oh, sweet, I can sprint. <laughs> run, run, run. Okay. So. The one thing that you remember from Finding Teddy, the first one, is that they had a lot of secrets that you can, like, go and find, that you had to go and click on. And it was, it had a very musical sense to it as well, which is kind of what I'm worried about, is that it's not going to follow through. Like, from what I saw, this looked like it should be its own game, not, not a sequel to a game if it's changing its art style. Am I going into the basement? Teddy! Um, Teddy's moving. Here's also the difference. In the first game, it was very much like a little girl's story. Like her nightmare that her teddy disappeared and that she went through a magical world. This just seems like I'm on a psychedelic trip. Now, I, I guess I'm at the age where I do shrooms now. Maybe. I wonder if uh, Tarrant's still in here. Like Tarrant better fucking help me. I mean, his friend. I mean, friends with him. Better help me. But yeah, this does genuinely seem like it's going to be a longer game. Genuinely. Seem like it's going to be a longer game. Graveyard. Oh, that's great. Start off in a graveyard. Hey, my teddy's here. Oh, I found him. Game over. Are we done? I found Teddy. What now? Pots? Really? Okay. Looks like this really is Legend of Zelda. Link. You saved the day. Come to save the princess Zelda. Again and took her away. And now the children don't play. It says... Oh. Alright, so... I'm, I'm thinking that it wants me to jump up there. I guess not. Do, 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 do. This is very different feel. Like, this doesn't feel normal for this game. Or from what I played from the first game. Wow, alright. Money. I think that's money or that's treasure. I can't really tell. I'm still on the fence about this. I Like I said, I love the art style so far. But this is weird. It's not Finding Teddy. Oh, hello. I'm liking the quickness of it, though. That's actually really nice. It's not too slow. Like, when I move, I actually feel like I'm jumping and speedy. A lot of a lot of parkour games have that kind of... Or platformer games have that kind of feel where it, if you jump on something, it just doesn't feel, like, fast. Ow! Okay, so that's my life up top. Slap! Ooh, money. Thank you. Slap, slap, slap. 
Ooh, what is that? Come on, what was that? Cool, got another one. Though. Oh, jeez, he dropped bombs. All right, so it's basically a paratrooper. Not paratrooper, but uh, whatever his name is. Hey, come here. Smack. All right. I, I'm just... Ah, I, I feel bad for uh, making you guys wait for some shit, but I, I have to break every pot. I just have to. I'm in Washington. Doing pots kind of our thing. I'm kidding. <laughs> but still, it's... Ah. Huh. Oh, right. I need to run. Huh. Huh. Not yet. Up there. Up there. Over here. Smack those. Smack a bitch up. Like that. Up here. Up. No? Okay. One second. And smack. Oh, damn it. Ah! Oh, God! Okay, apparently you can drown. Okay, I'm confused by this part. How would one... I don't think I want to push that down anywhere. Yeah. I wonder if I could just trigger it. No? How would I get up there? Yep, jump on your head. Oh, God damn it. Okay, I need to make sure I don't die here. Nope, I can't jump on heads. All right. Okay, so I can't double jump. That's a thing that I cannot do. Holding X doesn't make you jump any higher either. You can run and jump, but I don't think that's too much higher. Oh, wait. Yeah, it is. Okay, there we go. You just have to be really quick with it. Give me. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, cool. And I got... Oh, oh, that's life. That's life. Okay. That's what those orbs are. They're life tokens. What? Oh, that was accident. <laughs> that was accident? Wow, my English. Okay. There has to be, like, hidden secrets in the walls here. Like, I'm confused on what my goal is right now. In the first game, it was, of course, Teddy disappeared. You gotta go find him. Right now, it's Teddy went into the basement through a sparkly door... And I found him. He's right next to me. What am I doing here? Am I just going on an adventure because I'm bored? Um, how do I get down there? I see a hole. There's a hole right there. How do I... Oh, I think it's just a bridge. Got it. Okay. I thought it was like a building and there's like a dungeon thing underneath. Alright. So far, this is weird. I can't read the language anymore. That's weird. Go on here. The fuck? Um. There's voice acting now. I don't know if I want to go that way yet. Let's go back in here. <coughs> Alright, let's go this way. Oh, what the fuck? About those secrets. About those secrets. Where the hell am I going? Um. Uh. I think. Okay. Oh, did you look at that? Wow. All right, two chests. Money, money, money. Money. Am I like a marble collector? Because these might be like marbles. Anything over here? No? Alright. Okay. So. Oh, no? Alright. So that was something. So guys, there's a secret over there. They used to kind of point out the secrets. Like with that arrow. That was pretty obvious that that was there. Okay. Let's move on. Hopefully, I don't die anytime soon. Because I don't know if this thing... Sa I don't know how death works in this game yet. Does it save your stuff? Do you restart? Library. Okay, it looks like there's multiple ways I can go here. Let's go to the right. What is that? Is that arrows? Oh, no. That's... Oh, okay. Just a candle with wax dripping down. Got it. Okay, there's a locked door down there. That's most likely where the boss is. 
I'm now in the gardens. No, I don't want to be in the next area yet. So let's go look at this locked door. Okay. So let's go back and head to the left. Because this game seems fairly linear. And I don't want to end up going to a new area yet if I haven't explored everything. Is there anything else? Oh, okay. Okay, so... Back. Apparently, I can get new outfits. This seems like a large menu. Um... Alright. So, there's a parkour aspect right here. I see a way I can get up here. Or not. Oh, wait. Ladder. Ladder right here. Okay, I guess I can't get on the ladder. Huh. I don't... Hmm. Maybe I learn another jump later? Let's go in here. The fuck? Golden chest. I got a book. What, what does the book do? Okay, that's not what I want to do. Uh, oh, save. Confirm save. Awesome. This is a way... This is, like, way different than Finding Teddy 1. I kind of like it. I feel like this should be on, like, Game Boy or something instead. Not on Game Boy, but, like, Nintendo 3DS. Ah, I just showed my age. Um, yeah, this feels like it should be, like, on, like a game on, like, the Game Boy Advance or something. Because it does have that Legend of Zelda feel, which I like same time i don't want it to be too legend zelda because i don't want to clone okay so here's okay okay so i come back to the library because i need the eggs or whatever to go here because if you looked where is it where is it not here okay if you looked at the main title screen when it first showed me everything okay how do i get down uh problem um how how do i go down um Oh, there we go. Uh, eh, 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 eh. Okay. That's weird. But yeah, uh, on the main title screen, when you first like saw that area, um, can I, can I wall jump? No, apparently I'm going to learn new skills later. Okay. When you first saw the load screen, that's what it is, like the saves and everything, um, they had like four egg things, which I thought was like, oh, okay, so it's like Legends of Zelda, where you have to find like the four water temple, like, air temple, not water, whatever, 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 and then you finally get to the final area. Which seems like that's the turn this is taking. So let's go back to the garden. Hold on. I didn't go through this door. Did I come in through this door? Okay, yeah, that's the door I came in through. Yeah. And I did not go through the door that's up there. There we go. Whoa. This game is freaking gorgeous. Oh, my book. What's it doing? What? Do I have to go and get that now? Why did that... Okay, so I can't stand on that. Alright, cool. That's good to know. Huh. It's really hard to tell what I can jump on and what I can't here. Um, what is this? Wait, what, what was that? Hold up. Oh, it's Terrence! Is this his library? Okay. What the hell is happening? You far a forest? The hell did I just do? Okay, so... So notice how these guys have armor and a pike. What it looks like. Typically means... Okay, do they have auto? Yes, they do. Typically means they take more than one hit to kill. Which, yeah, I was right. Okay, cool. I'm gonna need some armor soon. I need more health if this is gonna be a fact. 
Because I don't think I'm supposed to be here yet. I think I found something out that I wasn't supposed to know yet. I have no idea when I'm putting this series out.